68 Charger here. Welcome back to the page. On this episode, we're gonna be removing the OEM steering wheel and replacing it with a forever sharp one. Let me know if you have any questions, and as always, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Thanks for watching. So before we get started, I wanna do a really quick unboxing of the steering wheel. I decided to go with Forever Sharp steering wheel because I looked around and this is the one that I felt was gonna look best with my car. It's a leather wrapped and I like how it's a little bit thicker, or actually a lot thicker than the OEM steering wheel. I did go ahead and get the matching matte black horn, so this is gonna go right here. And then the final thing that I also got is I went to their website and found the correct adapter that's gonna go with the 68 charger. And uh, that one does include an extender, so it should leave it exactly at the OEM specs. So anyway guys, let's go ahead and get started. So we should only need a steering wheel puller. And then I ended up getting a Phillips and a flathead screwdriver. I can't remember which one I'm gonna need for this one, but um, just remove the horn pad first. And then for this, it is flathead screws. It is a three quarter size. The next step is just going to be putting in the adapter. The next thing to do is just to put on this guy right here. And I believe this one's going to go in as well. Now that it's somewhat aligned, I'm gonna put these little bolts in. These bolts are our 7 sixteenths. So the last thing to do is to put in the nut that holds the steering wheel in. And I may wait until the steering wheel is fully in there before I uh, tighten it a little bit more. This next step is just to put in the ground for the horn. Power is back on and it seems like we have a working horn. So at this point I can put the steering wheel on. All right guys, and there you have it, steering wheel is in. Overall, I'm very happy with it. Everything seems to be working just fine. Let me know if you have any questions, and thanks for watching, guys.